Hey everyone, today we're going to take a look at BattleBox Mission 13. Stick with me, you're watching Living Survival. So this is Mission 13, they call it their solo camping box. So it comes with a lot of uh, goodies for out in the woods, out in the wilderness and camping. There is actually a one man tent, which I'll show you in a moment. We're gonna start from the basic value, which is $24.99 cost. You get these speed, st uh, speed cinch uh, stakes. Say that five times fast, speed cinch stakes. They look very nice, they're very durable, high quality plastic. And uh, you just, the nice thing about these is you run your line through it and you can cinch your line without having to do uh, certain hitches and things like that. So you can snug down your, your tie out lines and things like that very quickly and easily with the, uh, the speed stakes. Next thing you get is the Zippo uh, fire starter. I've used this before, it's just some cedar fire starter. You break it up, works really good. You get the mosquito sticks which are these. <clears throat> this is their weekend sample pack. Basically just candles that you light. Give you guys a look at these here. Candles that you light around camp. And some mosquito sticks that you can stick into the ground and light. And it will repel mosquitoes. Basically like a citronella candle. Looks like the ingredients are citronella oil, lemongrass, and rosemary oil. Um, all things that mosquitoes do not like. You get the Exotac Fire Sleeve. This is a cool product. You put a Bic lighter in there and it keeps it nice and weatherproof. And it's uh, you know nice and durable. You can hook it onto your pack that way and carry around a Bic without having to worry about getting it wet. Also get a Light My Fire Camp Spork. These are really nice. I have the titanium version of this. Exact same thing, just in titanium. This is the plastic version, but these are very, very durable. Great item to have, very lightweight. And you get the Self-Reliance Outfitters Mini Inferno. This is just the, uh, basically the wax cakes that are very nice to use for fire starting. And then you also get the tin that comes with it, which is also multi-use, so that's cool as well. Once you step up to the $49 pack, their advanced pack, you add in the, uh, the Maxi Deet insect, re insect repellent. This is from Sawyer, this is good stuff. I use their uh, pyrethrin spray, I believe that's how you say it, uh, on my clothing and things like that to repel ticks and mosquitoes. So that's some, uh, some nice mosquito repellent there. And then you get this camp stove with the $49 pack. Camp stove is nice, it comes with a, a nice size pot, it has graduation marks on it, rubber handles, which is nice, a, uh, a lid, which can also serve uh, dual purpose as like a bowl or even like a small fry pan. So that's a really nice part of the kit. Comes with this stand, you can use it as a, a wood burning stove. It also comes with a little alcohol stove that you can set in there, or you can also use this adapter ring here to use it with larger pots. This pot doesn't fit on the top of that, but you can use it with larger pots and use your alcohol stove that way. Lots of different ways to use this, uh, this little cook set. And it all goes into this nice little stuff sack. They also give you a, a little, uh, little microfiber cleaning cloth there, which is nice for cleaning the soot off and keeping your pack nice and clean. So really nice cook kit there. I can certainly see myself using that and then for $99 you get all of this plus the one-man tent which I'm going to show you in a moment and then you jump up another $50 to the pro pack which includes the Gerber uh, LMF2 survival knife this knife on its own is about a hundred dollar value so I think you are getting your value there very durable knife I reviewed the strong arm before and I know that this one is very similar and very durable as well so out of the Gerber products that I like, this is actually one of them as well as the strong arm. So a great deal 
getting that in this month's battle box. So your battle box subscription this month contains this one person shelter, which is pretty cool. It's got a nice nylon stuff sack to it with two compression straps and then sort of this dry bag style compression strap up top. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this set up and we'll see how easy this is to do. Very cool one-man shelter, very easy to put up. Goes up in less than five minutes. The fly has its own tie-outs here. They give you plenty of aluminum stakes, which is nice. And then they put this shot cord on there. That's really nice to have on your tie-outs. It helps prevent shock from wind and things like that. And it snaps back into place, even if the wind is blowing really hard. I put that on a lot of my tarp tie-outs for hammock camping and things like that. Looks like you've got additional tie outs here that you could further support the tent in really windy conditions. Got a zip here to get into the main portion of the tent there, which is great. Don't have to remove any part of the fly. And then on the rear side here, have another tie out to further stabilize the tent. So very sturdy, very secure. And you got well, you know, adequate coverage with the fly. So let's take a look inside the one man shelter here. As you can see, there is plenty of room past my feet here. I probably have another foot there. And then I have another foot of room up where my head is. There's probably about two feet or so of headroom. You really can't sit up in here, but you can certainly lean up. It looks like there's a little pocket on the side. That's cool. And it's a bathtub style. So it comes up on the edges there to help keep the rain from getting in. You can see you have a couple little Velcro tabs there that you would want to hook to your, uh, your, your pole that goes across. That would keep your fly centered rip stop material on the fly. And then all this mosquito netting in here, so no bugs are gonna get in. And of course, on a warmer day, you could take the uh, fly off and sleep out under the stars. So as you guys can see, another great box from BattleBox. I think this is maybe the best one yet. This is the best one I've received so far. Comes with the one-man tent. I mean, that's awesome. Plus that LMF2 knife from Gerber. Fantastic deal. It definitely is worth the money. Now, again, as I said in previous videos, it's up to you to decide whether you like being surprised or you like just buying things on your own. It's definitely more for the person who just wants to buy, you know, pay for a subscription service and then get uh, surprised every month. But as you can see, you do get a lot of quality items uh, in this particular battle box and other battle boxes that I've reviewed and seen. I'm going to leave a link below to battle box where you can check out their previous boxes as well as sign up for their service hope you guys enjoyed the video today please give it a big thumbs up for me leave me some comments below make sure to share this video to your friends and family who might be interested in a subscription based box such as battle box and as always guys make sure you click that red subscribe button and subscribe for more videos